Marius might expand on is appreciation, isn't it? Yeah. So it's appreciation of life. And I think it's a, a beautiful way to put what we're actually going to be thinking and talking about. And the other theme, I suppose, that we want to explore a bit is the, the link between the arts and the sciences. And of course, you know, lurking behind all of this is, is the whole issue of suicide and um, I guess the transience of life. Life's short and we definitely don't want it to be any shorter than it has to be. So that's, that's, um, that's a very key theme for us working in mental health, especially when we're working with young people. This film's been made for uh, quite a few different reasons, but one of the really core instigators was obviously um, losing Billy. It really did have a, a big impact on, yeah, my perspective of life. I feel like it's very easy for me personally to just get so caught up in very kind of things that seem like a really big deal, but at the end of the day, they're really not. I think perspective is just really key to to life and uh, being able to, um, you know, make the most of it. For me, what I'm really excited about with this project is just being able to share that through a very creative and artistic medium of film and, and art. And um, it's been really amazing having discussions with with Pat and uh, other members of Origin about that crossover between uh, art and and the science of what you guys do in order to try and um, tackle some of these uh, issues. Our business is basically trying to reduce the risks of young people in particular, but obviously any human being prematurely ending their life because they feel there's no other way or they're desperate or they, there's too much emotional pain for them to handle. And we're very confident that that's a, a very achievable task. You know, that most suicide is preventable. There's this trail of devastation, basically. You know, um, People are really damaged by... by losing someone in that way. Like, it's not just a straightforward grief situation. It's very complicated. So how do we actually deal with it sort of individually? How do we deal with it um, as, as a whole society, as a community? Um, how do we prevent it? And, and we can't prevent it if people don't even know it's happening. It's very common, you know? Hundreds of young people every year die from suicide. It's the biggest killer of, of young people up to the age of about 35, 40. Um, much more important than the road accidents. You know? And look at the amount of money that's spent on preventing the road toll, which is a good, obviously a good thing to do, but we're not really tackling this issue. So this is why it's great to have this sort of discussion and partnership about the issue and the, the waves and the water. It's all so evocative and so very much using music, art, creative things to sort of understand and also do something about it as well. Um, we, we can use these in very creative ways ourselves. So we're learning how to do that. And so it's great to have the chance to, to be inspired by Darius and his wonderful work. For me, the ocean has been a huge part of my life since I was like four years old and we first moved to the beach and um, I've always gotten so much from the experience of um, being in the ocean but I think it's really more since I've moved to Melbourne and been in the city and been away from it that I really appreciate the value that it has on uh, my well-being, you know, just having that time to connect with such an elemental force. I think the film was trying to use the ocean as a metaphor for life, but also kind of tap into that feeling that I and I know a lot of other um, water people get from being so connected to it. I'd also just like to quickly say that Patrick happens to be a very avid surfer as well, and I didn't know that when I um, approached Origin with this project, so that was a very um, exciting uh, crossover there. I'm excited about the potential of how my art can work with Origin and, and other organisations to, you know, bring a, a, a seemingly very heavy subject matter to, to a young audience in a way that is digestible and open and accessible 
and uh, yeah, something that makes them feel maybe a bit safe to talk about it. If you'd like to show your support, please share this with your friends and also subscribe to the Being Here YouTube channel and check out some of our other videos. You can also follow the links below to our website and other social channels. Thanks so much.